Today, what I wanted to do was talk a little bit about the future and where this is all going. In order to solve this problem, there are so many difficult technical challenges in VR. So we're going to focus on a couple of key problems here that we need to solve to make this done. Now, my first experience in remote social presence was this little thing called Toy Box. Many of you might have tried this in VR. Since then, we've shipped Facebook Spaces and made significant progress version over version in enhancing the realism of the avatar. And this, again, is where AI is a game changer, because we're now at the ability to take a single photo and create a near photorealistic avatar from that single photo. So what you're going to see is the person speaking and then their avatar moving as they this speak. This model was trained on PyTorch, translated via Onyx, deployed on Cafe2 into spaces to be run with this next generation avatar. Este modelo ko PyTorch se train kiya gaya hai. Durch Onyx übersetzt. Cafe2 übersetzt. Il lanzado spaces pour créer cet avatar dans Sanya Toyga Hui Taojang. You can see an example here of two of my colleagues working on this problem, communicating with each other in VR. And this is what they would look like when they see each other in VR. You get why I'm so excited about our vision of being able to connect across distances, and why we think we can solve this problem in a way that no one has seen before. And this is why we are so fired about, up about VR to this day, because we think it will be the only way we will get people to connect over very large distances.